For those of you that don't know, I have a portfolio that I am investing in every single day that the market is open in hopes of sharing the power of being consistent and doing something every day. And up until today, I was depositing $20 a day into two stocks, just Tesla and PayPal. And since the last video, there have been a couple of updates that I want to update you on. So let's take a look. All right, so here we are in the interactive brokers platform. And just for clarification, the brokerage is actually called interactive brokers, just so that there is no confusion there. Uh, going over and looking at my positions, you can see that I currently own PayPal and Tesla. PayPal is currently trading at 62.41. Tesla is currently at 177.74. I'd like to take a moment to be present because right now I'm looking at these stocks and I'm over here wishing I was buying PayPal when it was at 50 earlier in the year and that I loaded up on Tesla when it was at 140 and loaded up on Tesla when it pulled back to 100. And when I really think about it, I feel like ultimately I'm going to be glad that I bought in every day because when I think about the potential of these companies and what I expect them to do, and I like to take this time to say I'm not a financial advisor. This isn't financial advice. This is just what I'm doing. So these are my decisions. And should you decide you want to do something like this, you need to make your own. But I personally see both of these companies going a lot higher, personally in these positions with the perception that both of these positions from where they are are going to more than 2x. So getting back to it, let's uh, look at how we're doing overall. All right, so right now my overall cost basis on PayPal, I've put about $487 in. And as of right now, I'm down about $19 on it. And Tesla, I put about $423.76 in. And as of right now, I'm up $14.28. I'm down 4.1% on PayPal and I'm up 3.4% on Tesla. I don't think I'll be down on PayPal too long, much longer. It looks like people are beginning to wake up to some of the potential that I've seen. So this may be one of the last videos that we see PayPal at this price, but only time will tell. If PayPal hangs out below here, I'm more than happy to continue to pick it up at low prices. But if it wants to start moving, that's cool too. And there are a couple other announcements I'd like to make about this portfolio. I believe last time we took a look at it, it was around a little over $10,000. Now it's over 1,500, so, so it's a new month. We got a new deposit. So we deposited $500. And also uh, just yesterday, I believe, I increased my daily invest investment from $20 to $22. And how I decided to go about this, I didn't put an extra dollar into each, I decided to put an extra two into Tesla just because I want more Tesla. So now instead of investing $20 a day, I invest 22, 10 in PayPal, 12 in Tesla. And one other thing I wanna make a note of is I haven't had this interactive brokers account that long and they're sort of a more traditional broker it's not like a Robin Hood, so I'd like to quickly just talk over the fact that with investment institution, there's power in the strength of relationships. Uh, the better and more consistent you are with a certain institution, the, the more they're going to do for you, the more they're going to trust you, the better your relationship. I'm starting to notice my relationship with interactive brokers improving because at first, when I made deposits, funds would be on hold until a couple days after the deposit cleared. But now that I've made a few deposits, now that they kind of trust me, Robinhood and some of the other newer beginner platforms do this right away. But now that I've made some deposits and we have a little bit of a relationship, they actually give me access to the buying power as soon as I make the deposit. It's really nice. It's nice to go from a place where you're not getting anything to at least getting something. So note that is kind of a pleasantry. For those of you that made it this far, thanks for joining me on this journey. Hey, we got this account to 1500. Next goal we're looking for 2K. If you enjoyed this video or learned anything, be sure to smash the like button. If for some reason you're new here and haven't already, be sure to subscribe. And if you have any questions, comments, anything like that, leave those down below as well. And last, but certainly not least, thank you so much for watching. Matthew Manuel signing off, and I want to change your life.